hey you guys welcome back to another video i know i've been gone for like a very long time but i'm back and i told you guys that sometimes like uni is very hectic so it's kind of really hard for me to balance like uploading videos and school at the same time you know <laughs> i actually also failed one of my modules so i'm really like going through the most right now that's what i'm saying like uni is very hectic but I don't know why it was that necessary for me to tell you guys but I just wanted to put that out there <laughs> anyways on today's video I'm just going to I'm just going to talk about my top three reasons on why you might not be losing weight regarding the clothing challenges because to be honest i really got like so many dms of people who are telling me that they couldn't lose weight um what they did wrong what they should do right and all of that so i figured out that why do i not just do a video telling you guys my top three reasons why you might not be losing weight and i know there's so many reasons why people don't lose weight but i just feel like it's best if i discuss the three top reasons because i don't really want this video to be like long like you know like because i actually hate talking a lot i don't know if you guys know because i just be rambling you know <laughs> the first reason i feel like people aren't losing weight it's because and don't get me wrong like chloe team workouts are so great honestly even though they're very hard sometimes but her workouts actually work based for like a lot of people and that's why she has so many people who look up to her because people are actually actually able to lose weight and i didn't only receive a lot of dms of people who um didn't lose weight i actually also got some really great feedback from people who were telling me that the challenges worked for them and i've inspired them and all of that and i'm just like I inspired you like this is like a very important reason I feel like people don't get the fact that our bodies react different in certain in terms of doing different workouts so just because Chloe team workouts didn't work for you it doesn't mean mad fit workouts won't work for you you get what I'm saying number one people should try other different challenges because I actually have done other challenges that did not work for me but the moment I saw that Chloe team workouts worked for me and they worked for me perfectly fine, that's when I actually really got it. Like, oh my god, okay, it doesn't mean if Chloe team workouts don't work for me, I shouldn't be trying other different types of workouts, you know? So I feel like that's where people get this whole thing wrong. Um, you should try other different workouts and see if they work for you so yeah i just want people to understand the fact that our bodies are different and won't react the same way to you know all these challenges from all these professional what do you call them professional 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 i just want to encourage people to do to try other different workouts from all these professional youtubers because i mean you just never know if those workouts are going to work for you or not you know so that's what i did and it's so crazy that i actually also thought that i can't lose weight within two weeks but i was surprised when i did the chloe team workouts and saw that i actually can and yeah but the craziest thing is that when I was doing like other workouts from other different YouTubers, y'all, those workouts did not work for me, okay? <laughs> those workouts did not work for me and until I actually realized that the Chloe Ting workouts worked. So that's like the first reason that people should get. Also, I don't want people to feel bad with their bodies because you are very beautiful like the way you are just don't let anyone bring you down because yeah i used to be so insecure i know i'm kind of i'm kind of still insecure and trying to work on my confidence and doing these different challenges actually boosted my confidence you guys i don't know if it's just me but i feel like you feel so good about yourself and you kind of feel like 
you can achieve anything literally i just don't want people to think that i know everything like i'm not a professional but i'm just talking from my own experience and i know people will have like a different perspective but it's like i mean this is <laughs> my reason you know so the second one is checking what you eat this might be through dieting or i don't know because it's so crazy that i still lose weight and i don't even diet but yet i still lose weight so i feel like with me even though i don't go on any sort of diet when i did some of the clothing workouts but dieting is actually very important i mean this goes back to what i just said our bodies are different and i might not go on a diet and lose weight okay and you might go on, you might not go on a diet and not lose weight like that's just how this whole thing is i just don't want people to think a certain way about me saying that i'm not even going on a diet but i'm talking about going on a diet when doing these challenges just because i didn't go on a diet and i lost weight does not mean you're gonna lose weight you know but i know a lot of people who actually do lose weight even not going on any sort of diet you know and to be realistic with you guys I actually eat healthy I don't know if I've said this before but my mom kind of motivated me to eat healthy when I'm far from home I don't really eat healthy like I'm at home you know cuz you know when you're alone like you're the one who has to do the cooking and even though I'm not perfect in eating healthy all the time but it's very important to continuously eat healthy I just really want to place that out there like you can't expect to see massive results in two weeks and not eating healthy like does that even make sense <laughs> that does not even make sense okay with me i feel like i try to balance eating healthy and having junk at the same time you know to be honest i don't have any specific diet but i still do eat healthy even though i don't eat healthy all the time so yeah i feel like i've already rambled a lot okay <laughs> like i talk like you guys i need to learn to like speak in front of the camera in proper english okay i know like english is not my mother tongue but it's like i mean i'm trying okay i'm trying i'm trying i'm a i'm an african Sotho girl okay <laughs> this is why i hate speaking in front of the camera because girl i just be talking i don't even know what i'm saying like i do have the points but it's like I'm trying to like find that specific word but I can't remember it like ugh. anyways so my third reason would be this is also like the most important reason out of all the reasons that I have thought about is that sis just because someone lost weight in two weeks does not mean you're gonna lose weight in two weeks okay I would love for people to actually take time for themselves and maybe get themselves like a whole month to lose weight and see how far they get and not actually hold on the fact that you can lose weight in two weeks like just because your next door neighbor or just because i lost weight in two weeks does not mean you can lose weight in two weeks like that's a fact and that goes back to what i just said that our bodies react different okay let me just fix my hair let me just fix my hair when you do all these challenges make sure that you're motivated and you don't get discouraged because the moment you get discouraged like your mind is just gonna that you can't lose weight you can't be thinking in a negative way and get positive results like that's why i feel like being motivated when you do these workouts is the most important out of all these things i've just said because people aren't motivated enough and they aren't determined to like actually lose weight you know so yeah you guys um i don't know if you guys actually got um my top three reasons why you can't lose weight when doing the chloetin challenges i actually felt the need to like do this video and i'm very happy that i got to do it because a lot of people were like asking me through DMs and the comment section on why they can't lose any weight and I don't really just want to 
I don't want to demotivate anyone and you know just I just want people to be full of positivity if you have a goal to like lose 20 pounds like girl you can do it like don't let anyone tell you that you can't you can actually do it you know but you actually have to give yourself enough time to figure out what works for you and what does not i hope that you guys enjoyed this video i know like i said a lot of things some of the things might not be necessary <laughs> to be put out there but i'm really sorry if some of you guys didn't get what i said but i just hope you understood what i was saying and please subscribe to my channel like this video comment down below on the different types of videos you guys would love to see from me and i actually want to do like vlogs but it's like my life is so boring you guys like i barely even have friends like i don't got no friends you know what i'm saying like <laughs> no my life is so boring but hey i'll try to like do vlogs maybe later on because i feel like my channel is like growing and i just also want to thank you guys for like subscribing because i'm actually really shocked that people are subscribing like what do you see from me i'm kidding um but i just actually really appreciate each and every one of you guys for subscribing to my channel i just really want to be open a little bit more with you guys that's why i was thinking of doing vlogs other different types of videos so yeah thank you guys so much for watching may god bless you and keep you safe bye guys bye.